Hello everybody, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we are watching season three, episode three of Mob Psycho 100. I am so excited for today because I've not been able to watch any episodes of Mob in like two weeks almost because I have been away from my computer, but I am excited to get back into it and watch it. I don't know whether this episode is going to be a more chill one or anything like that. Last episode, we saw Mob and the rest of the crew join a yokai hunter and they were hunting yokai and they took down the yokai king <laughs> and it was really really funny it was good it was really easy obviously for mob and sarazawa sarazawa but it was overall like a like a more chill episode it wasn't too serious but i'm really curious to see whether it starts amping up like next episode or maybe the episode after because I feel like in the first two seasons of Mob Psycho the first like two or three episodes were kind of like low-key and then it ramps up after that so this might be another chill one I'm not too sure but I also could be wrong I'm excited to get into it anyway I'm also still really curious about where the fuck Dimple is the last time we saw him he was just laying on top of like the big broccoli tree and we don't know what's going on with that or like whether he is actually full-on betraying mob I hope he's not but we're gonna have to see <laughs> I'm really excited to get into Mob again and to finally restart season three again. Before we get into it, if you enjoy my content, please leave this video a thumbs up and subscribe down below as well. And without further ado, we'll get right into episode three. I love her little mobile charm, it's so cute. Yuck! It was a rainbow! <laughs> oh my god, why are they so insistent on coming with her? Why do they want to see her snot so bad? Aww. What rude friends. Is he helping or is it serious? <laughs> oh, <laughs> our boy. Oh. He's only blushing a little bit. I'm so proud of him. <laughs> Oh, I miss Mob so much. I'm so happy. Yeah, no. <laughs> oh! We haven't seen her in ages. What is happening? I mean, he does have lots of friends now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, they're all whispering about him. Oh my god! <laughs> Not the... <laughs> okay. Are they looking at Ritsu? No. Hearing things. <laughs> oh my god, he looks so different. Oh my god! <laughs> Why is he a Giga Chat? <laughs> what is going on? This is so funny. Oh my god. Okay. I thought maybe it was like the new big bad. Oh 
Yeah. Oh my god. What is this red and green? Is this dimple? No! Oh, I'm so scared. Ooh. Oh my god, she's got the Psycho Helmet poster. An audition? No! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, half a million. <laughs> His voice has changed as well. <laughs> Looks like Rock Lee. Oh my god, Dimple! Yeah, he's bigger now as well. Like, he's more flamey rather than squiggly. Oh no! Oh, does Dimple want him to do it as well? Mm, okay, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's just a peace fun religion. Giga Mob is so funny. Dimple just wants to use him. He doesn't need to be a part of it. Good boy. Ah, that's that must be why he looks more flamey. Oh. Oh, didn't even say hi to Ritsu. <laughs> It's just like Gintama. Not you too, Reagan. He has gained more popularity. This is going to be big. Oh my god, they've got mugs and stuff? I want a mug with that on it. I wonder if there's one on Etsy. Oh. Yeah, I feel like everyone wants this except for mob. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh 
Oh my god, so true. What's about he's gonna get there and no one's gonna like put two and two together that it's him? Oh my god, he got like full on money from Reagan. That's crazy. Moglo. <laughs> Oh, yeah. We saw that. Oh. <laughs> yeah, Teru. I like how Mob's focusing on the girls paying attention to him, though, rather than the city. Ooh. Why a monkey design? Oh, he looks so happy. Oh no. Oh no. What's he wearing? <laughs> High horse mob is so funny. <laughs> no, he can't be wearing that. The colors are cool, but like, no. Oh, there's so many like subgroups. Wow. Oh my god. No. I mean, he's not the worst, maybe. <laughs> I want shirts like that. <laughs> Did... Wait, who showed themselves? Oh, he's gonna miss out. That's not him. No, who is this? Oh, no. Oh my god, what is wrong with him? He looks like a plant? No, uh, liar. Oh, he looks so weird. Oh no. Oh no. Oh my god. Is he psychic as well? Whoa, what the fuck? That's gotta be like a plant psychic user. Or like maybe that's a plant. Oh my god. What is who is that? I don't answer me. But he looks enough like mob or like the the picture. I was thinking that really anyone can just like look at the the poster and the symbol that looks like mob and dress up as that person like this person has done. If it's even a person, like it looks all not veiny, that's the wrong word for it, but like all stringy. And I feel like it's not actually a human being. And like maybe it's being controlled by like a, a psychic plant user or something like that. 
I have no idea <laughs> what is going to happen. Mob's character is really interesting in this episode as well because obviously he has gotten a little bit more popular and he's made more friends and stuff like that. It's just really interesting to see how that gets to his head. I think it is somewhat normal though. Like I feel like it's not a huge concern at the moment for like Mob's character and because of how much of a loner Mob was before, I don't think it's too much of a surprise or too much of a concern, but I am really curious to see where things go from there because you even saw the contrast between Teru, who has been popular before. He is obviously kind of used to that or has experienced that before. And so he noticed, you know, the, the tree kind of coming up through the cracks in the street and stuff like that and growing. Whereas Mob, I'm assuming he's noticed it, but his focus was obviously elsewhere. It was elsewhere on the attention, which Teru has gotten in the past, but Mob hasn't until recently. So I find that really interesting, that contrast between the two as well. I mean, I'm happy for Mob. I'm glad that he's finally getting some respect and love and attention and everything. But I am worried about people using him because I know people have used him for the past like two seasons anyway but like Reagan made me really sad when he's just like oh my god no you have to because like you have to tell everybody that you have a master and that I'm your master and it's so clear that like you know it's a money-making scheme which is fine we all gotta make money to survive <laughs> but it made me a little bit sad because like right before that we saw dimple as well who was just trying to convince mob to become the founder as well for his own gain i suppose and M dimple as well looks really different like he's like a little ball of green flame now or he's got like spiky hair compared to kind of the blob that he was before so I think he has gained some sort of power and Mob did say that as well. So I feel like while not a lot has happened, we got a lot of information out of that episode. So that was really interesting. But if you have any thoughts, leave them down in the comments below. Please, as always, no spoilers. I'll also leave all of my socials down below in the description as well. I've got a Twitter, Instagram, a booktube channel if books are your sort of thing. And I also stream on Twitch as well. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a fantastic day or night wherever you are. And I'll see you all next time. Bye.